Hello and welcome back to Fate Stay Night Heaven's Feel. Hello, I am back from other stuff too. Part of the reason I ended up uh, ending the episode last time, and this is after that, uh, I'm back from watching Adventures Endgame. It was good, I cried. Good movie. Nothing else beyond that, I will say. Good movie. Little, you know. And I I'm a hard person to make cry. I am legitimately. Even things I find sad, it, it takes a bit to get to me. I'm not like they're bawling or anything, but I didn't just tear up, I legitimately had a few tears come out of my eyes, like... Yep. Good movie. Not great, but good movie that does well at what it's supposed to be. So... <laughs> what were we gonna do? Oh yeah, what will we do? Will you obey me no matter what I tell you during a battle? Hmm... I will say yes, but I honestly don't know. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's much easier to say yes to. So, so これから私に絶対服従ってことでいいわけね。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。
レミア君には私の家で部活動をしてもらうから I want to object a little bit because Sakura is not great, right? I sort of want to go check on her ASAP 部活動って遠坂の家だよ Can we have club activities at my place? I'm sure that won't help Sakura and her mood But still I'm starting to remember the fact that there was some weird shit going on last episode. Oh, Endgame blocked that shit out of my mind. Darn it. So, Teo Kun da Ijo, Anata o Hitori demo tatakaere yo ni oshie komanaku cha ikenai de sho? Oh, interesting. Ma, Emiya Kun ga shiroto da te koto wa ano yoru de wakatte ru kara. Renjitsu i nokotte mora u koto ni naru kedo ne. Ya, sore wa kamao nai shi, mushiro tasukaru nda ga, sono, kyo kara? あったり前よ。まずエミヤ君の力量を把握して、今夜からの方針を決めないといけないもの。帰りはかなり遅くなるだろうけど、エミヤ君は一人暮らしだから問題ないわよね。え、いやその通りだけど、なんでそんなことし
Muttering to myself, I gained my composure and go in. This place certainly does have a cold atmosphere, but that's nothing. She has no idea what a big deal is for a guy to come over to Zaka Rin's house. Well, I'm sure she won't understand even if I explain it to her. If I'm lucky, she'll just laugh. Wait. With an utter lack of concern, she shows me through the living room into, in, into her bedroom. ここのがきぐが揃ってるからだけど。今はお茶を飲むところだし、別にお茶しに来たわけじゃないでしょ? I wish she'd think of me as a boy her age. Oh, I, 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 I think she might. Oh,とにかく適当に座って。what does that mean? Saka opens the box by her bed? It looks like a treasure chest from an adventure movie. Uh, uh, そこの男を判別するのにそこまでする必要はないだろうがね。ねえ。私の勝手でしょ。で、持ってきたらしばらく下で休んでて。彼とは協定を結んだんだから、いちいちご遠慮しなくてもいいでしょ。そうだな。その
Same basic style, too. The girl in the picture looks just like she is now, except younger. That's why I noticed the one thing that is different. What? The hands? The book? お待たせ。準備は整ったわ。これから少し痛い目に遭ってもらうけど、気にしないで。どうしたの、エミヤ君？I assume she's doing like the gem thing that she was that she did in the uh, first round. あ、お父さんがこれ。I show her the picture I found. なんだ、昔の写真じゃない。隅っこに置いといたんだけど、それがどうかした？ it's nothing much, so I hesitate. It's nothing I need to ask about, it, but it just, you know, got my attention. Oh, so Is that what we are getting caught up on? Because she's wearing a different outfit, too. I nod. So no, Ah, well, she's right now that she mentions it. It's just an ordinary ribbon. Why was I so concerned about it? Nantene. So eat I to Korodakedo, Kamido meva to Kibitio. Onna no Majitsuni tote, Kamiva Saigo no Kirihuda de Show. しばりつける物だって相応の魔術品なんだから替えの白物なんて滅多にないわ。わな。じゃあそのリボン何らかの魔術品なのか。ええ。髪を止めるってことは魔力を貯めるってことだから。当坂は魔眼持ちじゃない
said when you had to say I mean it was it really easy or did you just like exceed when uh, exceed your typical stuff when you were in a crisis situation Tosaka asked me a few questions while I cast strengthening magic whether I'm self-taught whether I can use any other spells how could you taught me and what I have the easiest time imagining swords so Saka's expression darkens further with each answer I give and by the end she shut up entirely I don't know what she's angry about, but it's really awkward to be here if she makes a face like that. Basically, I'm like a lost cause, right? Tosaka, その当然だとは思うんだが、あまりの未熟っぷりに呆れて協力関係になったのを後悔してるとか。Not because you're such an amateur, because you're such a lost cause. Oh, <laughs> 後悔はしてるけど、未熟って言っても。あなたの場合は教え方が間違えられていたっていうかよくもそんなやり方で今まで命があったっていうか I'm just joking about the lost cause thing I know Archer is a thing that basically proves it wrong but still sort of not completely wrong おいトサカ話が見えないぞ Why is she glaring at me? いいわとにかく根本から直さないとダメみたいねそれとさっきの話だけどエミヤ君の工房には投影したものがまだ残ってるって本当 ?The things I projected?、Okay. 残ってるよだって壊さない限り残るだろう普通 Wait what now? Wait he projected things I thought he strengthened things in his... I don't remember this detail I told her that I used projection as a breather in between strengthening magic It seems Sasaka is、uh, particular about it. Told me to use projection using the clay. She told me to make a vase. Everything started out smoothly, but in the end, I still failed. To be honest, Emiya can give a switch on and off. I'll show you. In fact, I'll show you a switch on and off. I'll show you. In fact, I'll show you a switch on and off. I'll show you. In fact, I'll show you a switch on and off. I'll show you. In fact, I'll show you a switch on and off. I'll show you. In fact, I'll show you a ここでか何よその顔半身なさい別にメス入れるってわけじゃなくてちょっと薬を飲んでもらうだけだからまあ効果が強すぎるんでしばらくは動けなくなるけどねあ,あいや荒領事が嫌だって話じゃなくてだな I look at the clock it's almost five I didn't notice this is cloudy today but it's getting late Saka is helping me as a fellow magus It makes me happy and I'm grateful, but I'm worried about Sakura too. I should.、Uh, I mean, if I, I can't stay all night, I really can't save. No, no, I, I, I really can't. I'm worried about Sakura. I feel bad, but I should clearly tell her. Tosaka, so you can't do it. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't think we'd go that direction. I just figured I'd go and check on her. Okay. That works. That definitely works. Eh? Uchite Emiya kun no ye? Na. Sakura ga kaze de nekonde runde. Yoso mite o kita inda. Hitoban nekomu koto ni naru nara. Uchi ni kaete Sakura no yoso mite o kanai to anshin dek nai. Oh, you weren't gonna be able to rest easy regardless. Shima. So yeba so datta. She's astonished that she forgot entirely about Sakura. It's only natural when anyone would get mad if someone asked to cooperate. I told them today is a bad day to train. Baka, more than I could take it at a cocoma de Chitomena Catanoni. She stands up as soon as she yells at me, then crosses the room and puts on her coat. Hikuayo, Uchi de Arcota, Smasetashi, Ato, Amyak, no ye de Modekirua. Sakura no cambio go at a Suzuki or Surkara. Isoy de Modorimasho. It seems like she, she wants to go forward with Emia, but then she's just like looking at Sakura and feeling like, damn it. She's already won, or like she feels bad for soccer, or something like that, and she wants to help them move along, even though it's like not quite what she wants. Ah, so she can help them. 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 Ah, Saka walks down the hallway. Okay. 
I took my head in wonder, but I followed Sasaki and leave the Sasaki household. Okay. Inter. <laughs> what did I All right, we can have like an interlude per episode on average. The second hand on the clock ticks loudly, causing her to look up. It's past four o'clock. School's already over. And he should be home by now, even if he went by the shopping district. She leans on the wall and murmurs absentmindedly. She feels heavy and dizzy. She's surprised at how quiet her voice is. The second hand is annoyingly loud, but her words are almost inaudible. One, uh... Only some sounds echo in her ears. The monotonous ticking of the clock. And the painful thumping of her heart. The two sounds enter her brain, even if she covers her ears. Her dizziness gets worse. Liar! That's why she sent the housekeeper home. Oh, come on. She is down to her normal temperature when she checked it. And she's safe to cook her own lunch. And she's just fine after lunch. And oh, she waited eagerly for his return. <sighs> what is up with that, too? But her whole body is hot now. It's getting way worse. Oh, goodness. I hope the heat source isn't her. So it has to be something else. Please, Rin, have an idea of what's going on. Between her blood vessels, uh, between her muscles, there were... Uh, between her muscles where there are no spaces. Something that's not her is in there, turning like a car engine. Her fever is so high that it makes her imagine such a thing. And the abnormality is unprecedented. The sensation is strange and unpleasant. She isn't the only one that's in pain. Shared by the things in her body, crawling through her blood vessels and nerves. To speak figuratively, it's like puppies looking for the exit to a can filled with meat. The heat source, the things within her, are trying their best to fulfill their role. Thinking about that makes them seem charming, and she cannot make herself hate the sensation. What? Tokenoto. She looks up at the clock absentmindedly. It's 4.30. A bit longer. He should be back in a half an hour. She has to calm down and suppress things running around inside of her body by then. Are they the worms? Yeah, she is used to this. She has been disciplined and reformed many times since she was a child. She tells herself that it will be no trouble this time either, but her fever does not go down, and the things within her keep speeding up. Her body does not calm down. She's never been able to. What's missing? What she needs? And what has changed? She tries hard to think about these questions, but the ticking of the clock keeps distracting her. <laughs> when she realizes the sound is not the clock, but a warning from the house itself. Oh no. A familiar person enters, barefoot in. おい、おい、どうしたさくら。エミヤがいないと思ったらこんなところに一人でこれはじいさんの言ってた通りライダーを使いすぎた反動かな。うん。He comes into the living room and walks over to the girl leaning against the wall. She tries to run but she can't muster the strength. No, she had no will to run away from the start. Even if she gets away, she can never truly escape. The one looking down at her has a fixed smile. Yes. 
お前もあいつの顔が見たいだろうからさ特等席で見せてやろうと思ってさ Oh no The boy grabs her arm and hauls her to her feet Tries to get away, but lacks the strength to do so. The man pulls her in and grabs her neck. So, Kurunayo Sakura. Emoto Aniki no Yukoto, Sunao ni Kite o Kumondazo. Oh, man. Yada. Chiga. Yaksoka got to go, Nisa. Sepa Niva. Motena Sushinai, they tell me. She protests. Her hair disheveled. He stops her with his foot. He's like a young kicked her stomach. <laughs> Collapsing to the ground, she lets out a moan. Yasashi da ro, bokua. Gee, san karazgatta mono maru kedo. Dekireba sonna mono a tskaita kunainda. He forces her to her feet. Uh, he grabs hold of the coughing girl's neck once again. He puts his mouth close to her cheeks and whispers in delight. <laughs> With her neck held, she, touch, she shuts her mouth in vexation. She tries to accept this turn of events, thinking that it always ends up this way. So, so. Sakura wa ii koda na. Sore jaa hito ashi saki ni itte iyo ka. Koko de matsu no mo warui shi. Douse asobu nara, boku no tsukutta jinchi ni shoutai shi nai to. Raida, Sakura wo tsurete kuru nda. Giving her a violent shove, he exits. Raida. A girl. The girl raises her head. There stands a servant with long hair. <sighs> when he said that, like, have I used Ryder too much or something like that? I wonder if that's connected. She's having her magic. Like, she's having her magical energy. Like, like my speculation about her being the true master and possibly being a magic source for Ryder? Maybe? Maybe that's why she's getting so sick and down in the dumps. I raise my voice as I go into the house. Then, I feel something strange as soon as I enter. She doesn't even need to tell me. There are footprints on the floor. The only shoes I see are Sakura's. The housekeepers aren't there and the house is dead silent. Sakura. I go into the guest room. It's empty. The strange feeling turns into an ominous conviction. I return to the living room. Sakura isn't here either. Footprints and here in the living room. Somebody came in here with his shoes on, did something in this room, and then went back outside. Yeah, I know. Sakura's waiting for me alone in the living room, but is not here now. There are unfamiliar footprints in the hallway. That's all. It's more strange not to draw a conclusion. The answer is clear if I think about it just a bit. Calmly. 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 Calmly think. And I can tell what happened here. So why? Why is my head not working at all? Just a minute, I should have come home earlier. I should have thought about it more seriously. Did I have Sakura stay over for fear of just this situation? Matsuzo can said Sakura is unrelated. Why did I believe his words? There's no way she's unrelated. She's part of the Mato family. So why? Why did I believe such a convenient story? The phone rings. I nod to Sakura and slowly pick up the receiver. Moshi, moshi. It's Shinji. There's no mistake about it. I knew this is what had happened. Sakura, what's that? Ah, 
どうしたって迎えに行ったんだよあいつは僕の妹なんだからいつまでも他人の家には置いておけないよシンジ<笑>いいねカッカ来てるじゃんかエミアサクラを連れ戻されて悔しいってわけだ Saka must be able to hear Shinji's voice because she's leaning forward. I raise a hand to stop her and urge him to go on. それでついてるんじゃないのかついていないあれはサーバントの差だお前の力じゃないセーバーさえいなければ僕が逃げるなんてことはなかった今だってセーバーさえ出てこなければ僕が負けるはずがない Yeah, you say as you're, gonna, as you're going to bring Ryder s a b e r doesn't come I see Ryder must, uh, must not have told Shinji that Saber was eliminated Oh, that must be why he kidnapped Sakura. In short, this phone call is. Shinji. Sakura wo dou suru ki da? It's so pointless as a result, too. Busso na koto o yu ne. Daiji na imoto ni dou mo shinai sa. O mae ga hitori de boku no tokoro ni mukai ni kuru nara. Na. I stopped the Sakura. If she interrupts now, there's no telling what Shinji will do, and it also removes the possibility to surprise him with our cooperation. And I was heard through the phone. I hear the sound of him kicking something. お前こそどうなんだエミアお前はマスターかそれともただの臆病者か My goodness, he's unredeemable in how they characterize him わかったマスターとして戦いに行くぞああ戦いになればの話だけどね I put the phone down I start off right away 待ちなさい本当に一人で行く気なのあんたそういう指定だ。父さか、話は後にしてくれ。後にしろって、それはこっちのセリフよ。シンジがサクラを連れて行ったのは、目の前で自分の力を見せつけたいんでしょそのまま行けば殺されるわよ。今のシンジに自覚があるかはわからないけど、そんなの見せられたらサクラだってたまんないわ。I know. We do not have the time. I can still hear her moans in my mind. そうか、さくらの前で殺すかな、シンジ。<笑>それはわからないけど、可能性は高いわね。エミヤ君、大丈夫あなた、冷静そうに見えるけど、もしかして逆上してる ?I've lost my cool. Is she asking me if I can only think about going to the school and punching Shinji in the face? Well, I, I would be very interested if we could have just like an entire one of these like pages full of I want to punch Shinji. Shinji's gonna get punched. Shinji's gonna get punched real super duper hard in the fucking motherfucking face. Oh, then. Geakujoしてる。他のことが考えられない。今まで兄弟のことだからって口出ししなかった自分にも逆上してる。今のあいつはサクラの兄貴なんかじゃない。そんなやつにサクラを連れて行かれた。あいつから取り返してくれ。父
待ちなさいってばあなた一人じゃ助けられるやつも助けられないから私と手を組むって言ったんじゃないの I stop. Her words splash cold water into my heated brain. Sma, Kedo Sakura Gabnai. Hitorija Jesus Koi that the Wakatur Kato. Kosur Shkanai. Is Archer in a state he could kill Shinji from afar? The show, ne Shinji Ga Sakura, or Tsurete Rizo. I don't know how to do it. But Emiya, if you were able to get Shinji from Sakura to Sakura, then I'll do it as well. Hmm... I'll do it as well as I'll do it. Shinji? Shinji is not a rider. The servant is a servant. I'm going to be close to the servant. I'm going to help Sakura to Sakura to Sakura. そしたらたとえ1秒後に殺されるって状況でも絶対にあなたを助けるから。サクさん、サクシ、ちゃんとコンヴィンスヘルセフ。This あなたがちゃんと無事できちんとさくらを守ってあげてるって条件付きよいくらアーチャーでもライダーの相手をしながらさくらを守るなんてできない自分の身と引き換えにさくらを助けてもそんなの全然意味がないんだから The school building is deserted Thanks to the series of comas the school closes early It's not even six o'clock but there are no students or teachers to be seen 真摯の居場所はわかるか父さんあいつの性格から言って校舎の中でしょ高いところでかつ馴染んだ場所に陣取ってるに決まってるわ。So where we fought him in the fate round. And that could only be one place. Shinji is in the classroom on the third floor. 先に行く。父さんが後から来てくれ。ええ。10分経ったら私も正門をくぐるわ。You think he has that, uh. Boundary field still set up to like suck me of magical energy. I don't know if I've been talking about it, but I don't know if I've been talking about it. I don't know if I've been talking about it, so I don't know if I nod and start running. There's hot steel in my back. The magic circuit is already made. I tell myself that my only weapon is meant to protect Sakura, not to harm my enemy. Oh, for fuck's sake, you look so cliche evil, too! I stop. On the third floor hallway are a black servant and Shinji, holding a knife at Sakura. Oh my! My mind explodes. My feet start to move again. Then the black servant blocks my way. Uh, okay. Okay, 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 then maybe that was... Okay, you're calling him properly, Master, so maybe maybe technically tr that is true then. Hmm. In the same way, I suppose in English, in the same way as you're referring to your Master previously. I suppose there is a reason he tried to keep me alive, basically being this. I slide to an abrupt halt. My mouth hurts. I'm gritting my teeth so hard that they're screaming. Shinji. Yo, I thought that you were going to fly, Emiya. You know what you are, so I thought you were going to fly alone. I thought that you were going to fly alone. My cool brain boils up once again. My head shakes so much that I almost forget about the servant in front of me. What is that? Why is he doing such a thing? Because he's a pathetic little worm. I'm the only one. I'm the one that Shinji hates, right? I would come even if he hadn't resorted to this, but it's because he can't understand how you actually think. He thinks you're the same in some fucking stupid reason, so he wouldn't come unless this was happening. Sakura is Shinji's sister. An older brother should protect his younger sister. Family members should help each other and laugh together. So why doesn't he understand? 
something I can protect. Why can't he understand how Sakura must feel to have her own brother holding a knife to her? Before I know it, I'm running. I can't stop until I get Sakura away from Shinji. But she's in my way. Right is blocking my way, protecting Shinji. Riders, right. I have to calm down. Since I obeyed Shinji, I have to think only about saving Sakura and not defeating Shinji. I take a deep breath and pull myself together. Shinji is enjoying my dismay with Sakura in his arms. Sakura hasn't raised her head since I arrived. She's not unconscious. She's standing unassisted. Her head is down because she doesn't want to raise it. Shinji, why? Sakura, you were talking about your friends, right? I glared at him, unable to hide my anger. Huh? So? Ah, so you got it? Ah, calm down, Emiya. Yeah, she definitely totally knew everything, and she's just like, Oh, I understand what you did, so I'm gonna go, like, fuck with you. Oh, that's right. He presses the blade against Sakura's cheek. Sakura looks away but grits her teeth so that she won't raise her face. She doesn't reply. With her head down. ん何黙ってるんだよお前。いいから聞いてみろよ。エミヤがお前のことどう思ってるか、お前が薄汚い魔盗の女って知って嫌われたかどうか、ちゃんと自分の口で聞いてみたらどうだ。Her figure looks like she's apologizing to me, and I can't contain myself anymore. もういいだろ。約束通り来たんだ。桜を話せ。約束なんてしてないよ。したのは命令さ。一人でくれば桜には何もしないって。そう言っただけじゃないか。そう睨むなよ、エミヤ。僕だって鬼じゃない。妹を取り返したいっていうお前の気持ちは嬉しいからね。
これからうろちょろされるのも目障りだから23本は折らせてもらうけど Well, well, my legs, right? Just like Sakura is thinking, right? Right is not holding her dagger. It seems she really is going to go easy on me. <sighs> okay, yeah, re really, it's just all stupid pretense that see me get hurt. Ah, Kedo Kantan you are tower now, Amy. Ryder comes closer. Three more steps. Then I'll be within her reach. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
You know, that's, I think, the sort of thing that Ren and Sakura see as good points in me. I also think, you, uh, you know, Shinji, if you were a girl, you might be into... You might be into Amiya. <laughs> Damn, that hurts. My head's spinning, even though she didn't hit me there. Ah, Kedoma. The same? Are you stupid? What's the same about this? We're standing in a different position now. As you notice that I switched positions with Ryder. When I pulled him out of uh, myself up using her arm. Huh? Whose patience? Mine? Shinji's? I raised my head. What did Ryder just say? Ryder shakes off my hand. The Black Servant resumes her attacks with the artificiality of a machine. I'm being pushed back. To avoid finishing me off, Ryder's attacks stay clear of my vital areas. My body's numb. I'm bruised everywhere I got hit and I don't feel pain anymore. Because of the pain uh, with, from within is worse than her attacks. Right to attack me, destroy my body. The Black Serving closes the distance with an emotionless voice. And in that moment, I am certain. This isn't part of Shinji's plan. Ryder's decision is not to go for my head. And that I can still move my uh, body. It's not because Shinji ordered her to go easy on me, but... Easy. Ryder's hair flutters as she steps in and hits me in the chest with her most powerful strike again. I can't breathe. I don't feel the ground anymore. Her attack almost pulls me unconscious even though I knew it was coming. I hear a scream and I hear a scream and a delighted laugh as I fly through the air. Sakura's voice is close. I fall. Under normal circumstances, I would have hit the floor and died. The impact of a fall doesn't matter. It's intact strong enough to blow a human away. It wouldn't be surprising if the strike blew a hole through my chest. <laughs> but I'm alive. Anyone can jump back if the timing is set so perfectly. The attack wasn't meant to kill me. She kept me conscious and mobile, not because of Shinji's order, but of her own free will. Santa? The range is perfect. I jumped my body right before I hit the ground, straightened myself instantly. And grab the knife in front of me with my left hand. I catch it by the blade. I don't care about digging my hand because it's numb. I raise my other arm, and without a thought for the pain, I punch him square in the face with my clenched fist. I throw away the knife. Trying to have a look at the blood, I run to where Sakura's sitting. Sakura! Get the fuck out of here. Can you, can you get up and run? Sakura doesn't raise her head to look at me. She's trying to avoid talking to me. I don't know if it's because of Shinji or because of all the things I've hidden from her. All I can tell is that Sakura's body is hotter than this morning. Then, I realize that Sakura's behind me. After being wounded by Archer Riders crouching down on the floor. Her clothes are wet with blood, even though it's not fatal, she won't be able to continue fighting. I didn't make did I make a problem? I don't even remember. I don't care. So Oh, you were listening. Oh, you were listening. Awesome. It's only natural that you believed that I said I came alone. Did I even actually even say that I came alone? Eh, whatever. 
嘘つけ呼びもしないお前が通してくるエミアのやつバカ正直なふりして僕を騙したんだろうがああそれそんなの単純よあの電話の時ね隣に私もいたのマトウ君声大きいんだものエミア君が隠してても聞こえちゃった満足いったさくらが連れて行かれた以上私がおとなしくしているわけないでしょあんたはエミア君をおびき寄せる代わりに完全に私を敵に回したってことよ。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。ああ、そうか。そうか。さくらさくらさくらさくらさくらさくらさくらさくら信じられないお前もエミアと同類かよよく見ろ僕はマスターになったんだ Are you? You need that book, don't you? お前もマスターなら気にかけるのはさくらじゃなく僕だけだって決まってるんだよそうじゃあ自慢のサーバントに戦わせたらアーチャーは腹を裂いただけよ。具現化の確たる心臓と首は壊していない。あなたが一人前のマスターなら、今すぐにでもライダーを直してあげなさい。くっ、この、い。シンジスクラムズウェイン・テイクサーダ・ポーク。あれは立てライダーマスターの命令だ立ってアーチャーを倒せ There's no reply. Right is scratching motionless. A puddle of blood is under her, but the blood keeps flowing. She is the one who needs help right now. To order her to fight is to hasten her death. Boy, doesn't this seem familiar? Shinji's fingers t i g h t e n on the,、uh, the book. That must be how he uses his command spell. With trembling movements, Ryder tries to stand. やめろもう無理だ諦めろシンジそれ以上はライダーが持たない<笑>こいつらが簡単にくたばる玉かさあさくらを返してもらうぞ What would Shinji think if he knew that Archer was Emiya? What would he think? I wonder that Emiya rose to that height I suppose that reputation that、uh, well not really reputation but that、uh, quality Of, um, it's hard to say because it's not exactly a positive thing, but the just mere act of being a heroic spirit is probably be enough to push him over the edge. Shinji does not relent. I'd like to go soccer and rush at him,、uh, rush at him again at that instant. Sakura. I stop and turn back. Clutching her stomach, she moans as if in the throes of a nightmare. Shinji's book burns to ash just as it did that night. Wind blows inside the enclosed hallway. It's coming from Ryder, who's lying on the ground, and from Sakura, who's still crouching. Sakura stands ready while Archer silently watches the enemy that stood up. Ryder's completely healed. The power flowing from her body is just like she was、uh, at the temple at that time. Then. Her figure disappears. Ryder suddenly disappears from my vision. The moment I duck, long hair flutters right above me. Sakura! Ryder's instantly jumped with Sakura in hand. She lands opposite of us, between Shinji and the rest of us. What is that? Your m e a i s n 私はサーバントとして主の身を守っただけです。I'll take a polite little bow now. Ryder lets Sakura down and glances at Shinji. Her eyes are covered with a leather mask, but her expression is frighteningly cold. ばばか言うなお前の主は僕だ僕を守らないで何を勝手に Shinji、コマンドスペルはマスターの体に現れるの。
私はその身に成功を持たない者をマスターと認めたことは一度もありませんなあなたは偽物です疑心の書が失われた以上あなたには付き合えないラリチンズウェイフォンシンジーモーションテルシンジーダッシュオンネバーロケットエンそうそういうことだったのねライダー推測通りですアーチャーのマスターですがあなたならとうに気づいていたのではないですかええおかしいとは思ってたわ魔党の人間からマスターが出るはずはない魔党の血はもう廃れてしまって魔術を扱える人間は排出されないからだから魔党の人間であるシンジは絶対にマスターにはなれないはずだったなのにライダーは召喚され魔党の人間がマスターに選ばれたそうね私は魔党造剣があなたを召喚してシンジに預けているのかと思ってたけど話はもっと簡単なのよ造剣は手を下すまでもないだって今の魔党家において最もマスターにふさわしい人間はサッカー isn't looking at Ryder she's only looking at マトの正当な後継者。今代の魔術師であるあなただものね、さくら。いや。You know, this, this might be a little bit of an awkward place to end it, but I think that's a good place to end it, reveal. And she's probably going to admit it. And she probably knew everything. And she probably. I, I, I feel like I've been pretty on point in terms of my speculation about her. Probably some bullshit in there, but I, I do feel as though. So, I think I'll leave it there for today. I'll see you all next time. Drive safely, everyone.